Cinema for a Cause and Mending Minds and Myths presents Povidian Proximix Is Social Distancing Distancing Our Minds and Hearts Too? Independent filmmaker and creative explorer Abhishek Kanguli teams up with senior psychology teacher and eminent psychologist Shomdatta Banerjee to find out the answers to a constant fear we are living with in this Covidian world. Given the Covid situation we are in, how are you managing your social, personal and intimate spaces? Covidian Proximix Over the past few months, we all have experienced unprecedented shifts in all our lives due to COVID-19. One thing is certain that uh, adjusting to changes is definitely a challenge to all of us. Changes that can be sudden, gradual, planned or unplanned. Change is inevitable. Change is a part of being human. Keep it in mind that responses are neither good nor bad. Stress responses are different ways that we have adapted ourselves to threatening circumstances. Knowing our stress responses definitely helps us to identify our best coping strategies that align with our needs. Under such crisis situation, making mental health and physical health plans that fits our uh, current stress response is definitely helpful. So under such crisis period, the coping strategies that definitely helped me to get through this crisis situation uh, are somewhat like this. Number one is uh, structuring the plan of the day. Making a plan beforehand and uh, remaining consistent with the day's plan in regard to meal time, bed time, class, etc. Staying active, exercising, making time to do things that uh, that lightens my mood definitely helps to get through such crisis periods. Connecting with others, that's number two. Self-isolation and social distancing definitely calls for freedom, uh, feelings of boredom, frustration and loneliness. Uh, under such circumstances, it can be helpful to maintain a sense of belongingness uh, to others will definitely help. Setting boundaries with emails and social media is my third coping strategy. Uh, the current technological advancement definitely helps us to stay always online. So, but remaining online doesn't always prove doesn't always uh, happen to be very helpful for us. In that, in that context, selecting uh, one particular uh, medium or channel through which we communicate with others, professionally, professionally at least, that will definitely help me as well as it can help you also in order to maintain your me time, quality time with yourself. Number four, set boundaries for media consumption aim for uh, aim to be remain informed and not to be remain overwhelmed with information finally number 5 manage negative thoughts and feelings uh, take time to reflect uh, on your uh, mood and what is coming up for you is something definitely uh, helpful that is accepting your own emotions accepting yourself is something you can always give to yourself under such crisis period to know more connect with us covidian proximix watch this unique web series it is time that you are aware of the spaces around you.